Hi guys, today I'm going to attempt straightening my natural hair. So I already blow, blow dried it basically and then I went to go get my hair trimmed. So they trimmed it up for me. So hopefully this goes smoothly, no problems. Because most of the time when I straighten my hair, basically it reverts in like the next hour. So hopefully it doesn't do that this time. And if I don't straighten it really, like super, super well, let me know some tips and tricks that you guys do when you guys straighten your natural hair because I would love to know. But I did go to the store to grab a few things. I'm going to heat up my flat iron. I'm using the Red Pro Hybrid Titanium Flat Iron. Um, I like how this one straightens and it does have like the edge like straightener so you can like get up in there like the edges and everything so uh, this is what I'm gonna use it heats up super super fast but I'm gonna put it to the side while it heats up I did get some edge control this is from cream of nature hopefully this edge control is good and it doesn't revert my edges back to um, curly and then I got this argan oil this is anti-humidity humidity and gloss shine mist. Um, this is supposed to keep your hair from getting frizzy. And also it's a heat protectant. So it is good for what I'm doing. Because I'm going to straighten it. And I don't want to make my hair damaged. But I did grab this too. But I don't think I'm going to use it today. This is the Creamy Oil Moisturizing Hair Lotion. It restores, moisturizes, and softens. But I feel like there's water in here so I don't yeah the first ingredient is water so I don't want to use this because I don't want my hair to revert back to curly so we're not going to use that so we're just going to get started I should have got some clips I'm going to get some clips and I'll be right back okay so now I have the clips we are going to start sectioning our hair well my hair I really hope this goes well because every time I try this it doesn't go good for me so hopefully today it will go good so i'm just gonna section off the back section not too thick because you want your hair to be as flat as possible especially because you're gonna put heat in it so we want to actually make it straight this is definitely not a tutorial because i have no clue what i'm doing I just want you to know that so this is my hair I wish I showed you guys before I cut it but I didn't I was kind of like the spur of the moment I was like you know what let me just get my hair cut that's the first time I got my hair trimmed in like five years which is crazy so I'm just gonna spray some of this argan oil in my hair Ooh, it smells really good. Alrighty, so I have a small section. I think I'm going to go over it one time. What temperature is it at? It's at, I think, 370. I don't know if I should go higher than that. Like 400. I don't know if that's too high, but I know that coarse hair, you need a higher temperature, but not too high. So I'm going to do that first. So I got a decent amount done. I got this much done. It's looking pretty. I use a lot of oil because I know when I don't use a lot of oil, it reverts. So, <coughs> whoa. So I'm trying to use more oil this time. Because I know it's going to dry out anyway, so I thought it would be fine. But it's looking really pretty, super shiny. This stuff is really good. Um, it is keeping my hair moisturized so we're gonna keep straightening so i'm closer over here so i wanted to show you guys me straightening <clears throat> so first i'm gonna comb it out as you guys can see you can see the heat protectant on there and then i'm gonna grab it close to the roots and then pull down and yes it sounds like it's frying but it's not frying it's just the oil like someone's cooking in the kitchen, frying up some chicken. That's what it looks like. My hair is so shiny because of this spray. Oh my goodness. 
so pretty. Ooh. Okay, I'm finally on the last piece. Thank goodness. I don't know how long I've been at this. It didn't feel like a long time. I was just watching YouTube videos pretty much. And that's it. <clears throat> That is so scary how smoky it is. It looks like I'm frying my hair. Oh my goodness. My hair is so oily, but I feel like it's going to be okay over time. Like it's not going to be so oily. Oh my gosh, it's so pretty. It's never been this straight before, I'm telling you. Never. Never, 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 never. Like, since I've gotten a relaxer, it's never been this straight. This is crazy. Let me part it correctly. I don't know if I'm going to do my edges tonight because I'm probably going to go to bed soon. So I'm not thinking about slicking down my edges to go to bed. But I don't know. <laughs> my hair looks so thin. When it's not curled. Okay. It's so thin. This is so weird. This is so weird. But this is my hair. She cut off a decent amount. Because it was like boob length or chest length. And she cut off pretty much that much. Because she was like saying it was super thin on the end. So you might as well just cut it off and then grow it back. So it'll help it grow anyways if if I just cut it. But yeah, this is my hair. Super thin looking when it's not curly. <laughs> but yeah, it's so pretty. I like it. I did good. I feel like I did, did a good job. This is giving me like high school relaxed vibes. But yep, this is her. <laughs> I think that's it for the hair tutorial. It's not really a tutorial. It's kind of like watch me straighten my hair kind of situation. But I hope you guys enjoyed the video nonetheless. And if you did, give it a thumbs up. I probably will try to do more natural hair videos in the future. And if you want to see that, also give it a thumbs up. And um, I don't know what else to say. So I hope you guys enjoyed the video. And I'll see you guys in my next one. See ya.